Here we have the BT3520 twin digital cordless phone with answer machine by BT. Now this comes in about £35, so this might be decent if you want two phones, one for upstairs, one for downstairs, but with the answer machine. Nowadays everyone's got mobile phones, so technology on these looks pretty ancient, but this could well do the job for you, especially if you've got points at any of the major supermarkets, Nectar cards, club card points, etc. You might get this even cheaper. So it offers a blue backlit screen, hands-free speaker, saves up to 50 contacts, 60 minutes of messages at a time, long range reception. It claims to be energy efficient, recyclable packaging, recyclable or recycled plastic, anyway, whatever. And on the flip side, just tells you a little bit more information about the range. Apparently 300 meters outdoors, 50 meters indoors. Um, fairly obvious, see who's calling before you pick up. And if you wanna read any of them, just take a look. On the back, gives you a quick layout of what's to be expected, what they're hoping it can do. All fairly straightforward these days. It seems to offer the functions that you're gonna need. You'll find your user guide, which apparently makes it simple, plug in, charge and go. It's a fold out affair, explains the contents of the box, which we'll have a look at and gives you a rundown of the functions. So nice and simple, nothing major to report there. Two standard plugs and we've got a base station here. Let's take a look at the base station. Decent little unit, very plasticky, which you could expect for this price. That's where your phone will sit, delete, find, potentially hang up as well. Answer phone on and off. Play stop, the answer phone, volume up, down, skip, left, right. And potentially that is to pick up a call on speakerphone, but we'll discover that. And of course, You've got two, but notice this one is clearly smaller than this one. This doesn't offer the functions of this. So this you'll want to put in a place you're most likely to use the phone and this in the other location where you just want to grab it for convenience. So you might have this one downstairs in the hallway. This one you might have upstairs on the landing or in a bedroom. So you got it handy or vice versa. If you prefer listening to your messages in your bedroom, you've got that one there. But the old tradition was step in the house, look at the answer machine and you're away. So maybe that will go downstairs first. Now, of course, you've got the two handsets. Let's take a look at them. Now, these should be identical. And there they are. Again, plastic, lightweight, take rechargeable batteries, which I assume will charge via the bases. Let's have a look. So, already fitted, sound. Okay, so they want us to take this out, charge it up for 24 hours before use. Oh, they're simple, very basic very low powered rechargeable batteries. You could look into getting them swapped out for some better power ones, but as it's gonna be plugged in all day, there's probably no need for that. So we clip that back on. Buttons feel okay. Nothing amazing, don't particularly click. Seems to have a little signal bar there, battery bar there. Fairly annoying sound. Answer machine. But I imagine somewhere in options, there's an intercom button there. So you could just press it and call up to the one upstairs. But that's it, basically, very simple set of phones. Nothing really to go crazy about. Nice and simple. You're not gonna get anything stupid like games on or anything like that. Um, they seem to come with a tiny bit of battery, but good idea to plug them in in situ for 24 hours and see how you get on. But 
they seem decent enough, especially for the price. £35 for twin phones with answer machine is an excellent price. So not too bad for a home phone. Hopefully that's been useful to you.